In Mission Control, the team that for 10 years had been working toward this day watched nervously as Curiosity neared the end of its 350 million mile voyage to Mars. A decade of your life yeah. resting on what happened in that last few minutes. Yeah. It's difficult to describe. Adam Steltzner led the team that came up with what many called a crazy idea, landing the 2,000-pound car-sized rover on Mars by lowering it on cables from a jet-propelled platform. Lots of things could have gone wrong, but nothing did. Touchdown confirmed. We're safe on Mars. Then that room exploded. Yeah. Yeah. There were hugs, yep. high fives, yep. tears. Yeah. An image from a NASA satellite shows the rover dangling from the parachute that slowed its 13,000 mile an hour descent to Mars. As we were talking today, Steltzner was emailed another photo sent from Mars. That's a picture of our heat shield below Curiosity dropping away towards the Martian surface. Just came down. That's amazing. In high school, Stelzner seemed an unlikely candidate for developing the most complex planetary landing ever. I uh, passed geometry with an F plus because the teacher didn't want to see me a third time. You wanted to be in rock music? <laughs> Went from rock music to, <laughs> to, to, to rocket this. ships? Yes, 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 yes. Watching the stars one night changed his life, and now he has helped change planetary science. Curiosity being on the surface of Mars is something that could only have been done in the USA. That pioneering spirit continues? Absolutely. The ingenuity, the practicality, all of those things wrapped together are what's necessary to do a huge engineering feat like this. Curiosity has now started its science mission, expected to last at least two years. The first color pictures from its high-definition cameras should be received on Wednesday. John Blackstone, CBS News, Pasadena.